Here is another stair building code you should familiarize yourself with, and I will put the reference number to that particular building code in the video description box so you can go check it out. And of course, the building code that I am referring to will have something to do with the curve or a bevel that might be located on the front of a stair tread. And don't be surprised if you come across any building products, especially products for masonry construction, that are used for stair treads when they shouldn't be. Now the building code refers to a 9 sixteenths of an inch maximum radius. So the radius would be the measurement from the center of a circle to the edge of the circle or the perimeter of the circle and would look something like this. So this is the maximum. It can be smaller. It cannot be larger. Unless your local building authorities, people who provide you with the building code information in your area, suggest otherwise. So always check with them before building your stairs to make sure that you can or cannot use the information in some of these videos. And of course, here is the maximum curvature. Let's go ahead and take a look at the maximum bevel. And since the bevel was not stated in the same way as the curvature, I'm going to go out on a limb here and assume that they're talking about this measurement here that cannot be longer than a half inch. And since they are referring to a bevel, I would imagine that you could shape this bevel in a variety of different ways with a variety of different angles, as long as this measurement here is not more than a half of an inch. And of course that bevel would look something like this. And no, I would not suggest using a curve and then a bevel and then a curve. Use the same design for each one of your steps to avoid confusion. And as I mentioned earlier in the video, I came across a radius that was probably about two inches when watching another video about someone building stairs in what appeared to be England, where of course the building codes might be different. So again, a bevel not longer than a half inch, a curve with a radius that is not going to be more than 9 sixteenths of an inch.